Hello crafty friends. So, uh, I recently joined uh, Auntie Vera's crafting land, I think it is. I'll link it below. Um, this is the April Mixed Media Challenge. Um, and the first prompt that I'm going to do today, I've already got something stuck down here. Uh, I don't really remember doing that. I think it was just some bits that I had left over. I just randomly stuck it down. So we're going to carry on with that and just add a bit of text. So the first prompt scrap paper. So we're just going to add just a bit more to this page. Just get a bit of interest going in there. Um, yeah, I decided to start doing these because if you know me, you know I used to do sorry, I'm just going to my light <laughs> used to do Mike Deacon's um da -da -da -da, what's it? Mission Inspiration. And I tend to do it when it's like this, when it's prompt based. Um because this is kind of just the format that I like. Give me some prompts, I'll follow it. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear that in the background, that's uh, wind chime outside. It's a bit blustery today. So I'm just going to stick some of this down. Let's see how we go with this page. Um, yeah, so that should be interesting. Uh, add paint without brushes I think is going to be the next step that I do uh, and I think um, there's a colour that's blue I'm just going to go with some plain old gesso. Um, where are we? Grab my gesso. Here it is. Let me finish this top. Oh gosh. Oh, it's tight. One sec. Okay, back. <laughs> I keep forgetting to bring my jar open and back upstairs. Uh, oh, I was going to say it's all gone, but no, it's st still got some there. Um, pop some on. Let's grab a roller. without a brush. Um, so I'm going to need to dry that and I'll be back in a sec. Okay, the next step I think I'm going to do is add um, use household objects to stamp or paint circles and I think I'm going to use my archival inks that I recently purchased. Where is it? Still has some cotton on it, but never mind. This is cotton reel. And some different tones of blue. Might still be a tad wet, but that's okay. That one. Fake jeans. 
and then the mess up my hand. <laughs> Sure what these are, but my friend sent them to me. Like with lids off something, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna go for speckled egg. It might come out as a bit of a squashy circle because it's kind of flexible, but that's okay. dark prize ribbon. Um, what else have we got we could make marks with? Oh, straw. So rubbing that on then. It's not very circular. <laughs> Try the other end to see if that's better. Better. So, better. Grey. So that's the mask. We want the stencil. About there. Uh, da, da, da. It's a good shape. So I need to scribble, add dots and add a quote. So I need to find a quote. <laughs> I'll be back in a bit. Okay, so I found this stencil that says find your wings and fly. So let's have a bit more paint. Thank you. 
see. Uh, yeah, let's see. <laughs> Go a little bit there and go a little bit there. I think that's supposed to be a loop there. That's a chalk marker. I think that's that. So, let me just dry those dots off before I do anything else and smudge them. Give me a second. Okay, so the bigger bo box, bigger dots are still a bit wet. Um, but we should be able to move on. I'm going to take a white pen and just go quickly. Perhaps not all the way around, but just where it needs. Cleaning up.
Uh, scribbles. <sighs> this is something. Yeah, I don't really do very often. Scribbles. Perhaps I should have done scribbles earlier on, but I was kind of putting off. <laughs> Let's just grab the woodies. Sorry, this thing is so irritating. The feet on it are ridiculous. It's not a very stupid thing. The surface I've got it on is a bit slidey, so I'll just see if I can figure out a better tripod type thing for it. So, I've got that, and I'm thinking actually that I might. Oh, I've got no water in that. Let's just grab some water. and scribbly but just blend it a bit more water's not exactly too Got a bit of chaos to it. <laughs> okay, so let me just check. So we've got add a silhouette, add scrap paper, we did in the background, scribble, we've just done add paint without brushes, we added our gesso with a brayer. Use household object to stamp circles, we did, add dots, we did, and add quote, we did. There we go, we've done it. Hooray! So that is my first attempt at a challenge on Auntie Rio's Craft and Land. Um, it's chaotic, but I like it. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.